this demonstration we are going to see how to create a chamfer tool path over a controlled area for an example this profile having a D profile count above inside have a circle profile where I want to create a chamfer tool path over the edge if we do this that chamfer tool may hit this particular face so in order to avoid that I'm going to show you how to create a controlled chamfer tool path before that I will show you how to create a chamfer over a edge if you select this edge here select this part and you can specify the distance here and you can apply this you can have the chamfer over this area but I want to create a controlled chamfer so I just undo this function and I will show you how to create a chamfer using a curve method so I just undo here so I just select this particular surface I'm having here a option called a trimmed edge then I am selecting the which edge I want to create as a circle then just say apply now you just go to the top view of this profile draw a line here approximately to avoid the tool to hit the face so I just draw in here then I just trim the remaining area which is not necessary now if you see this uh, profile here I had created a curve 10 which is highlighted in red color where I'm going to control the tool path until this so to do this I'm going to create a feature from curve chamfer select the chamfer uh, curve profile area you may preview this and if you want to reverse the chamfer you can reverse it and say next and specify the depth of the location as it is perfectly right I just leave this area so I'm have just created with a chamfer of 1 mm here with the chamfer type as 2d then I have created a climb mill option depth first finish and just finish this profile as usual in automatic feature toolpath creation if you see this toolpath you can see it is controlled very much over a specified area also it is well cleared from the uh, next to the wall actually so you can play this toolpath here and it is coming again up so this particular chamfer toolpath will help you to avoid the surfaces which is to be avoidable thank you